Well, me and Nana are going prospecting. We've been planning this for quite a while. And I went to Johnny's and picked up the trailer. Nana's bringing the quad. And she's going to meet me here. And we're going to go out that, about 10 miles out that dirt road. That's where the gold digs are. Still a little bit warm. But I brought the generator and we can get to have some air conditioning if we need it. Yeah, she should be pulling up any time now. We'll see. Well, I just called Nana <clears throat> and she's on her way. She's about 20 minutes behind me. So I'm just gonna park here and wait for her. We'll take it nice and slow. It's a long ways up there and it gets pretty rough. We're gonna need four wheel drive. A little bit warm out here, but you know how the desert is at night, it, it's cold, so she should be here in about five minutes. We'll see. Here she comes. There she is. She made it just fine. Pulls that trailer good. Well, it looks like we're going to have us a convoy. Make sure it made it all all right. Yeah, it looks good. That'll be fun. Trucker Nana, she's got to use the bathroom. She, look, look, look. See? I knew it. Need a hand? Alright, there you go. Well, we're about halfway out there, and it's this is the rough half, the second half. I've spun a couple times. Nana's bringing up the rear back there. She's, I just called her, she called me on the phone. She's not spinning or nothing. I spun a couple times. Well, we'll make it alright. Just about there, maybe another 20 minutes or so. Well, we're on the last mile here, and we're going by the old talcum mines over there. Big old holes in the ground. And this last mile's uh, the toughest. Tougher than a hard candy Christmas, as old Dolly Parton would say. I hope Nana's car can make it. She's been doing good. It's four-wheel drive, so it should make it. The road gets real narrow up here, and it gets real rough, so. Well, all this way out in the middle of nowhere, and somebody's got our camping spot over there. There's a mobile home, motor home, or a trailer or something. Oh, well. We got neighbors. Yeah, they're, they're all right. I don't think anybody was as dumb as us to come out here in this wilderness, but I guess there is. Boy, this road is just rough. Hope I don't pop a tire. Well, we made it to our campsite. Dan's little car did just fine. Got unhooked and set down the jacks. Get her leveled up best I can. And we're far away from our neighbor over there where we'll be fine. There's Schmidt Tunnel way up on top of that hill. I've had videos of that before. And it's kind of nice out here. Something about the desert. Well, we got all set up. Got the shade. Nana's having her tea. Gonna play a game on her her phone. I got the quad off. It'll check my dig. Make sure nobody's over there. I better not be digging in my spot. Damn claim jumpers anyway. Well, if they are, I probably jumped somebody's claim too. So, all right, I'm gonna take a ride down there and see what we got. Well, I went on down to the dig, sir. Yeah, probably not even an hour. Ran it for a while. I wanted to check me and Nana's thing out. We made for the dry washer for the quad, so we can go in some of these spots and, and uh, it's easier for me to get to. So I cleaned out what I got when I got back and got a couple specks. Half yeah, of running. A little while is not too bad. Nana's got 
sausage and beans on the barbie and they're smelling damn good it's a little windy but it's nice boy the wind really picked up had to pull the old trailer over here and tie the awning off to it so it wouldn't blow away but we're sure getting a beautiful sunset and the wind's calming down now very very nice Still a little too windy to start a fire, I think. Maybe tomorrow. Boy, that's just beautiful. Look at that. Look at the orange. Very nice. Well, been out prospecting all day. Well, it's only about 3 o'clock. But I started early. I started about 7. Come home and Nana, look at that dinner Nana's got for us. Steak and beans. Mm -hmm. Hell, the pilgrims didn't have it that good. Very good. Well, day two of our prospecting adventure is coming to an end. Thought I'd capture our beautiful sunset for the evening. Very nice. Wind still kicking up, but. That's just part of the deal. Nice night. Gonna see the stars tonight. Alright, more tomorrow. Well, been working all morning here and took a pretty good bite out of this tailing pile. Still finding gold. They didn't get it all. Well, it's the last day. We're gonna go home tomorrow. Beautiful today. Wind's not blowing. Well, a little bit, but not like yesterday. Yeah, I better keep on digging. Well, I came back early. I shoveled till I just can't shovel no more. I'm just too damn old. So we'll get ready to go and head home in the morning. I'll take a ride on the quad later on. Nice day, warmed up a little bit. Not as much wind. Well, me and Nana are gonna go for a quad ride. Here, I'll get a, give us a selfie. Oh, it's Nana. Okay, hi, yeah. <laughs> Did it get you? Not yet, no. Oh, okay, I don't know either. All right, we're gonna go for a ride. Bye. Well, we rode the horse. All the way up the Schmidt Tunnel. She ain't no Harley, but she gets us where we want to go. And uh, it's a long ways, further than I thought it was, probably about seven, eight miles. You can see our trailer way, way, way over there. I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's probably closer to 10 miles, I would think. Nice up here. And I don't want a picture taken, but tough. Well, we come around the bend here and we found a fixer-upper for Noah and Christy. Yeah, new door and a little two-by-four here and there. As good as new, huh, Nana? Yeah. Well, we're our last night here. We got the quad all loaded up and everything pretty much loaded up. Just going to hook up in the morning and... Head out, first light. Here's a beautiful sunset. Maybe a little too bright to see. Had a nice time out here. Out in the middle of nowhere. And I think we've seen two other people the whole time we've been out here. Paradise, I guess it's not, but I like it. And that's all that matters. And Nana puts up with it, and that's all that matters. Well, we'll see if we can stay up late enough, late enough to see some stars tonight. We always fall asleep before it gets too dark. <laughs> it's, it's hell getting old, huh? All right, well, when I get home and process all my gold, I'll record more and let you know how much I got. I'm thinking maybe three or four grams, I'm hoping. We'll, see. well we made it home. And I cleaned out my 
all my uh, hard work. Yeah, <laughs> hard work. And we got some, but not, not like I expected. I thought we'd get a couple of grams. Hell, I didn't even a half a gram. Probably a quarter, eh, probably a half a gram. Oh well. Any day you find gold is a good day, huh, Nana? Yes, that's right. All right, well, better luck next time.